I've seen amputees with better hands than this. I'm out. Good. Stay out. I thought you'd come here to play cards. All I've seen you do so far is flick cigar ash over the table. Hey, Max, you gonna bet some of that money or just sit there gloating over it? Gonna do the accounts, mate. There's a wife and two kids and a coke habit to feed. <laughs> okay, big time losers, let's cut to the chase. I'll raise it 50 G's. Jesus Christ, Max. How come your parents warn you about everything in life except record producers, huh? <laughs> if your artists could see their advances now, eh, Maxie? If they saw the schmucks I was playing cards against, they'd give me their expenses, too. Well, I'd like to call your bluffing ass, but uh, only a moron would try to do that with a lousy pair. Well, that leaves me and the weirdo in the white suit. Is it my imagination, or are you a wee bit light? Oh, come on, pal. Shit or get off the pot. Callum? What do you think this is? A wife swapping party? <laughs> <laughs> this is the key to my ancestral home in England. It is a house which has given me great pleasure and good fortune. To me, of course, it is priceless, but to somebody like yourself, it is worth um, a million. I will see your 50,000, and I will raise you 950,000. You serious, are you? OK, Mr. Whippy. I'm intrigued. Guess we better see these cards of yours. Oh dear, a lowly pair. Not a bad bluff as far as it goes, and I like the little performance, but you need more than a cute line of theatrics if you want to make a fool out of Max Taylor. Vienna. <laughs> that wild card has been a friend to you all evening, Mr. Taylor. Well, we have a similar sense of humor. Did you dust before you left? You're a funny man, Mr. Taylor. But I've met funnier. And so will you.
Hi. Where are you going? Hell and Buckman. Aren't we all, love? Aren't we all? Well, look, I can take as far as London, but I'll make a stop off on the way down, deliver some stuff. Is that OK? Cool, you know? Great. You want to make it quick, though? We want to get stuck with the rest of these arseholes. Come on, come on. Chop, chop. Shift your arse. All right, mate. How's it hanging? Excuse me, love. Superb. I don't care if she thinks her fans won't like it. The public does what I bloody well want it to do, and so will she. Get a wig, stick it in suspenders, and reshoot the video on Tracy. No more calls, OK? You get about a bit, don't you? Will you walk a little faster, said the whiting to the snail. There's a porpoise close behind us, and it's treading on my tail. Didn't do the dust in. <sighs> Bastard. Dad, why are there cards on the wall? This is a games room, Harry. A room for playing games in. Can we play hide and seek in it? Well, I suppose you could give it a whirl. When the wheel of fortune spins. An ancient game of chance begins. But who could know or guess the rules? Adrift upon the ship of fools. Bastards fixed. Oi, Curly! Who's the axe man? Put it down, all right. It's valuable. Is it? 
What are you doing with it, then? It's my brother's, OK? All that stuff's his. It's been in storage and just taken it down to his new gaff. Well, your brother's a very lucky man. Too bloody right he is. Hey, see that guitar? It used to be mine, right? But like an idiot, I lost it to him in a game of cards. You still play a bit, then? Nah, no, not anymore. I jacked it in shortly afterwards. I got fed up with chasing rainbows and hung on my plex from... But what about all the sex, drugs and rock and roll? Oh, aye. I'll tell you, the way these things usually work out is an awful lot of drugs, very little sex and rock and roll. Too much acid in my case. Oh, dear. Yeah. Oh, another time, another place. I could have been up there with the greats. As it is, all I got from the trouble was piss-poor short-term memory and a hair full of broken bottles. Oh, well. Gonna laugh, haven't you? He loves it. He's having a great time. He's just a baby. If we stay here all night, sooner or later he's gonna get scared and have nightmares. Bollocks! He never gets nightmares. It's just an adventure to him. And as for Jamie, she couldn't give a toss about anything. You're the only one who wants to leave. And anyway, what happens if that tube of a brother of mine turns up and we've all pissed off, eh? Listen, Max. I love our house in L.A. I love our house in Paris. I know this is your home country and you're feeling kind of excited, but I'm telling you, no matter what you say, no matter what you think, this is not our home. So please, don't ask me to live in it, because I am too rich to be unhappy. OK, OK. We'll wait till Johnny arrives. Then go find a hotel. That's good. To. None of your business. Well, don't talk to any strange men then. Friend of Mark's, right? No. Mark got Callum from another poker school just to make the numbers up. It was a right idea and a bit desperate, I reckon. Not exactly ideal attributes for a gambler. It's like I say, fortune favors those that don't bloody need it.
Fanema. Oi, Bobby, Daddy. What is it, sweetie? Are you having sexual intercourse? Not at the moment, but there's a distinct possibility. How are you doing, sweetheart? Fine, thanks. I've been playing with the funny man. Oh, well, that's great. Take my advice. When you're entertaining late, always try and get your little ones down nice and early. Wise words. Judy! Judy, where are you? What's it now, Punch? Oh, Judy, I'm sorry. I've been a real bastard to you and the baby. I've done terrible things, but please forgive me. I've been a fool. Give me another chance. But Judy had heard it all before. She knew that as soon as Punch got drunk again, all his promises would count for nothing. And the beatings would continue. So she packed her bags, put the baby in its carry cot, and took a taxi all the way to the women's refuge. Well, that's probably the most embarrassing thing I've ever seen in my life. Excuse me, would I be correct in thinking that Mr. Punch is supposed to kill Judy and the baby? I think we just got the PC version. Pure crap. Sex and violence, mate. What the public wants. Arrivederci. Right. You got four bars to impress me.
Come here often. Give me all those birds down here. Two Swedish girls last week. Mind you, I know fuck all about art. But I know what I like. It's not the winning or the losing. It's the taking part. Max, get the kids! There's someone in here! <laughs> Welcome to the Love Gallery. Up, love. There is some good news. I brought you this. Now that is the way to do it.
Come on, jump! I said jump! 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 What? Look at the concern. Man. Hey, money bags, I'm here. Come on, cough up, you tight no, lad. No, Russ, no. You can't hide from me. Me know I see you in there somewhere. Me no know who you be. Oh, where you do your soul. But if me catch you, me I tell you why. Me just kick your evil little ass all the way around the fourth dimension. You are here, me, sir? Well then, what? <laughs> Christ, some set of lungs on that girl, eh? Oh, yeah. And she can shout a bit and all. Well... I don't know where my brother's got to, but his car's here, so he's got to be skating around here someplace. Oh, come on. Give us a hand get the gear out of the van, eh? Love. Nobody no move because me no want this circle break. 
Fair enough, do your horoscope. But jacking up in public, that's taking the piss. You know, hear me, man. You don't know everything you know. But you think, say, you see everything. You think, say, the world go around you. But me, I tell you, boy. There's a whole heap of shit go on down here that you don't even dream about yet. For four hours now, me, I get some bad vibes. So move your ass. Gee, this is weird. It, it's kind of like the seance we had at college with Emily Watson. She was my best friend. Anyway, she was contacted by her dead grandma about getting extra math tuition. And maybe she is in some strange... Enough! Oh, no. I, 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 I. Now, listen. That bird in there is a couple of tins short of a six-pack. Comprendi? Mm -hmm. Good. I just what think that I we suggest do... we do... Yeah is that we have a quick shifty around for my brother. If we don't find him, we leave a note and we all bugger off. OK? Uh -huh. Good. But you can't just leave her here. She needs help. She's pharmaceutically challenged. What do you suggest I do? Start my own bloody methadone program. Now, look. You two check the grounds, while me and Joan Rivers here check the inside. We'll meet back here in ten minutes, OK? Come on, you. All right. Thank you. Very much. Oh, Christ! Where the hell has she got to now? John, a number of years ago, I attended a series of lectures at Stanford University, and I am convinced that there's some kind of, like, weird psychic mystery behind all of this. But, Elmer. Yes, John? Shut your gob! Oh, Christ. Look, I'm sorry. Velma, you're obviously a very bright girl, yeah? Well, why don't you use some of that intelligence to help me? Velma. Your mission is to go down that corridor and to find me one nuclear family and one Jamaican smackhead. Go on now, Velma. Meet your classmates back home proud of you. This is ridiculous. How do you mean? Well, it's the middle of the night and it's fucking freezing. I mean, who in their right mind you'd be standing about outside? I mean, what am I doing standing about outside? I've got my balls hiding halfway up my ass, shivering, and I don't give a flying fart about travelling Wilbury and his stupid fucking family. You're getting really stressed, man. 
You ought to relax. Yeah. You know what you should try? What? Breathing exercises. Breathing exercises? Oh. Why don't you go and kill yourself? Hold on. What's that? I'll tell you what that is, mate. That's a 35 yarder. Straight into the top corner. There's not a goalkeeper alive could save that. Yeah, nice one. A duck. Now that definitely is a duck. Look, man, I know where you're coming from, but the way I see it, you know, women are more than just, well, mobile orifices. Yeah? Well, what do you know about it anyway? All I'm saying is that we can't go back to the days of selecting a partner by banging her over the head with a club. Oh, I see. So now you've got something against banging women as well. You're not a puff, are you? You're just not interested in communicating, are you? Will you, won't you, will you? Won't you, won't you, join the dance? Did in it? Yeah. Oh. All right.
never like small tones. Quack, quack. Quack. Come on, little ducky. Come on. Quack, quack. Quack. There really is nothing to be frightened of. Quack. Darn. Come on. Just can't figure it out. I know you're there somewhere. Quack.
here! Mr. Taylor! Mr. Taylor! Perhaps he's having a cape underneath that rubble. Hello? Mr. Taylor? It's a bit dark down there. I was just wondering if I could borrow your lighter, because mine's a bit sort of... thing. No. So These must be the old service tunnels. They're all derelict now, though. Hello? What's the score then, mate? Psychedelic wig evening. You what? Psychedelic wig evening. Come here. 70s disco. Get into that. On you go.
Coming through, yeah? Yeah, oh yeah. Get, get in some, get in some. Get in a bit. Yeah, yeah, I am. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm good. I, I, it's all right, but it's not really me. Right, yeah, yeah. Now this. Classical. Classical, huh? Yeah. Classical. Aye. Very popular with a lot of our senior citizens. <laughs> oh! Bloody hell. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. All right, all right. Now, this is you. That is 90s rage. Rage! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Drive on. Yeah. Yeah, happening. Yeah, getting some. Yeah, no respect. No respect. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Do you like that? Do you like that? I like it. Do you like it? Yeah. Do you like it? Do you like it? Yeah. 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 You like it? Forty-three quid. Forty-three quid. I'll take it. We might as well go back. Hello out there. Look, I can't see the door from here. You'll have to shout so I can find my way out. Ha, ha, ha. Très amusant. This is really juvenile. Oh. Oh, good evening, sir. Can I help you? Is this a family business? Uh, no. Oh, I'll have a lager then, please. Would you like a complimentary lager, sir? Oh, yeah, thank you very much. Uh, that'll be 17 pounds and 63 a new pence, please, sir. And we'll call it 20 pounds of cash. 20 quid? I thought you said it was complimentary. That's just the name of the lager, sir. And there is a £5 service charge, sir. £5 service charge? And an additional £5 for chair usage. I'm standing up. Seated patrons only. Bloody hell. This better be good. Oh, yes, sir. Ever so sexy. I got my ass kicking boots on tonight. 43. 63, 68, 70, 73 quid. What can you get for 73 quid these days? A wig and a lager. From the heavens reaching down through time and space towards the ground, the bitten hand of fate unlocks the secrets of Pandora's box. You and me against the world. <laughs> so much for that. Uh, that's life, eh? Maybe I never had the talent. Funny thing is, deep down, I'm pretty.
proud of you. Even if you are the luckiest sod alive. Excuse me. I can't find my way. Fuck my ass. Well, there's absolutely bugger all in the papers. Oh, hello. It's showtime. <laughs> what the bloody hell is this thing? It's a bleeding lump. What's it look like, you stupid tart? Well, get him, pull it out! You what? There's one too many big lumps in here already! Great, I'm having another one hanging about! Well, I didn't bring it in, you old slagbag. That's right, mate. You tell her, eh? Ooh, that's typical! I suppose you're gonna piss off down the pub! Oh, no, he isn't! Well, where is he, then? Behind you! Mind your shell suit, missus. What the friggin' hell's that? It's a tossing bomb, innit? No! Oh, shit! Bomb, everyone! Bomb! Bomb! Take cover! Run for your lives! It's not fair! It's not... I tell you what, you can't whack a good bit of family entertainment. No, you can't. Oi, oi. Ta -da. Oh, I do like to be beside the seaside. No, I do like to be beside the sea. <laughs> Mid your ship on your bed. You did what? You know, see how the atmosphere nice, no? You dirty cow! You not like it? Then get your big ugly ras down here for an even bigger surprise. Oh, I don't know. There's always one, isn't there, eh? What? What? Damn right there is. Come on, get on with it. Before this bloody wig runs out. Oh. <laughs>
teasing me. I'm teasing you. You're a naughty boy. I'm not. Get him off! Bloody hell, I feel like I've died and gone to Rotherham. Come on, big boy. Someone here? Yeah, a bit of skirt. Ample sort of bosom on her, is it? Oh, yeah, you could say that. Right, ample. <laughs> she had a tardy sort of blonde wig. Yeah, that's her. Yeah, yeah. 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 Big hairy old arsehole on her? Yeah, well, probably. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Big ugly, eh? Oh, hey, nice singing voice. Old woman. Bit of a scrubber, you call her, is it? Oh, yeah. So you would call her a bit of a scrubber? Well, I would, yeah. Yeah? Well, everybody would. Yeah. Yeah. God, yeah. You know her, dear? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> it's my wife. She's got a smashing personality, though. Smashing personality. Blind, is it? Do you think I am? You what? Don't you think I know what's been going on behind my back? Nothing going on behind your back. At it, the pair of you. Day on night, night on day. I don't know what you're talking about. I lie awake at night, crying. Crying into my pillow. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm very sorry to hear that. And the kids, screaming. Screaming here. Look, all right. I think I get the point. No, but you don't, see? But I do. No, but you don't get the point. But I do. But you don't. I do. No, but you don't get the point. Oh, I do, I do. I get the point. No, we don't get the point. Oh, I do. I get the point. You? Yeah. Oh. Yeah? Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah? Come here. Yeah? 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 Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah? 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 yeah. Come on, then. Big hard man, are you? Bigger than you. 
Well, let me shot, do you? Yeah. Come on, then. Yeah? Come on, then. Yeah? Yeah, that's what Want some, do you? Yeah, I do want some. Want a bit, do you? Come on, then. Yeah. yeah. Not from you. Come on, then. You want a bit, do you? Yeah, come on, yeah. then. Now, see, you still don't get the point. I do. No, you don't, see? Because I got the point, yeah. I do, I get the point. This is the point. <laughs> you have a point, yeah. <laughs> April 1975. Dear Max, I'm writing to ask you a favour. I've been hearing great things about your brother's band, and Johnny in particular. As you know, we're looking for a new lead guitarist at the moment, and I wondered whether John would be interested in joining our band. Could you ask him for us? I know you also represent Ronnie Wood, Ronnie Wood? So if John doesn't want the gig, perhaps we could talk terms about Ronnie. Cheers, mate. Mick Jagger. You never told me. Huh? Your own flesh and blood. And you fucking stiffed me. Huh? All these years, I could have been someone. But you... 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 BASTARD! Make a splash, that lad. He certainly does, Trevor. He certainly does. <sighs> Boom, bye, bye.
Ба, бле! Dr. Blatter, remember me? Long time, no see. See? What's happening, man? Don't no one tell you nothing? No. You've been called to greatness, man. This is it, the big time. Wow. They're all waiting for you, man. Who? Who's waiting? The angels are grooving us, man. Right. They're all there. It's Elvis. Elvis. Jimmy. Jimmy. Janice. Janice. Bing. Bing. Latest, the greatest man. They're all waiting for you. Right. You gonna take your guitar to a shining star, man. I am. With a rainbow rivers cry diamond tears. Where the paper swans glide across marble skies. And the air, all oh, the air takes as sweet as honey. I haven't got a fucking clue what I'm on about. But it does bring a tear to my eye. Hey, you're not jiving me, man, are you? Shit, no, man. It's all cool, you know? Who? <sighs> Why? The big D, man. Destiny. Everything you should have had, you now had. Yeah. Your time has come, Johnny. How's it? The gods are waiting. Yeah. I can see them. It's true. It's really true. Play that funky music, white boy. <laughs> It's like my 
old dad used to say. They don't like it up them. And they don't, you know. They don't. Looking for you. Who the fuck are you? My card. 
Playing cards again, Mr. Chance? You really should try and play with other people. It's much more fun. Is it? Righty keeps it slamming on one FM. Steve right in the morning. Good morning, this is Steve Wright. Now, ten years ago, a tragic flying accident took the life of the greatest rock legend ever known. Our all-day tribute starts with his number one song from 1976, the emperor of rock and roll himself, Jonathan Taylor. Deep in some dark old place in my brain I can switch on the light I can turn on a flame Dreams like your eyes are fading fast And each new road Well, it seems like the last I just don't write about that anymore. I want it. I'll take it. Ooh, yeah. Still. Turned out nice again. Ha, ha, ha. 